back here in Santa Corsa and we're going to be doing some no hezi today. They reset the leaderboards and it's never been easier to become certified. So we're definitely going to be trying and uh, show you some of the attempts and let's jump to the first video. All right, so here's how it works in no hezi. Um, it used to work that you get a multiplier by running with someone close. So it used to be the meta to be in a group or with another player. Uh, but now they've reduced the proximity multiplier to a 3x and the speed multiplier stayed at a 10x. So the new meta is to stay in light traffic and just stay above 200 miles an hour as much as you can and you're able to get a high score that way. Um, to make the no hezzy leaderboard has to be, I believe when we tried this was 46 million points. Um, it's probably a lot higher than that now. Ah, shit. I think I just flew over the uh, bankment there, but whatever, that works out for us. Oh no, he lost smoke. Good thing uh, it didn't block up traffic. Ah, no. Okay, a million points. At the three minute mark. I like, uh, I think they got rid of rain, but then they like kept the rain sound in here. Like, it's like, it's not actually raining, but there's the noise of rain. We still have 18 minutes to go. We are not. I mean, we're pretty much on track to uh, get certified, I think. The most nerve wracking for me is like if I'm going to do like a little mirror tap or something. I'm worried about that more than anything. Because if I do like a big hit, that means I messed up pretty bad. Most nerve-wracking part is the turnaround, because if there's a lot, of, like, if some of those guys are just fucking around on the starting line, like that guy, we it might just ruin our, our run here. No, no, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Ah. million points to start. Not bad. First five minutes. Gotta lift a little bit there.
Ooh, that was close. Alright, the two notable turnaround portions on this circuit are going to be right after this blue tunnel. So right after this blue mint, you know, black tunnel, you'll be coming up to the overchange that you come out of the pits at. There's a turnaround spot right up there and I'll show you it in this clip here. So that's where you want to turn around for your drive back towards the pit. Heard someone taking off in this direction so hopefully they don't mess up the run here. PB. That was close. Glad there's a gap there between those two cars that are right next to each other. And then for your other turnaround point that you want to use, these are like the new ones that are better than the previous ones where you could go through two lanes. But on your way from the pits, you're going to see that green bridge. You want to turn around right before that. There's going to be a pedestrian bridge here. You see that above it? You're going to look for that, and that's your turnaround point. So keep those markers out for those two turnaround points. Uh, yeah, those are the main things to look out for. There's one right before this too. There's some other locations as well, but those are the last two zones before you get to the pits or you get to the two lanes that will make it a lot harder to do a turnaround. 12 minutes left. Seven K combo. Be a little bit more cautious now because we are towards the end of it and on our new personal best, so. Then 
don't want to screw it up at this point. Oh god. Oh god, sometimes I'm getting a little too close for my own comfort. About 10 million points away from uh, getting certified now. stretch we are on the home stretch now okay that made me pucker a little bit I thought uh, I was gonna hit that oh no 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 oh my 599th place oh we are so unlucky mm. So unfortunately, we end up hitting the two cars here. There's just nothing we could do. Normally on the right lane, if you are in the right lane, it should leave a gap there. But I guess with the toll booth, it ended up closing the gap and we just had nowhere to go. But we still got 599th in the world. So I guess we'll try again next time. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you next episode. Have a great day.